Hello everyone, welcome back to another Adobe After Effects tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to take tripod footage, footage that is stable, and make it look like it was shot by hand or handheld. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Here's the original, and you can see here it's quite stable. It looks like it was shot on a tripod, very little movement. And then I've gone ahead and made some adjustments, and now let's see what it looks like. It does have that organic handheld motion it looks like somebody was just filming it by hand how do you do it very simple let's start from scratch so here's the original footage and i'll just scan through it nothing happening on it it's all tripoded out the first step you want to go over to your effects and presets panel like i am right here i'm just going to delete this so i can show you from the start effects and presets type in wiggle when you do that you're going to get the wiggle position before I apply that to this though, I'm gonna go ahead and make a copy, Command D or Control D, and that makes a duplicate depending on if you're on a PC or Mac. So now we've got two versions of the video stacked on top of each other. Drag, wiggle position onto the top one, just like I've done here, and presto, it applies a one wiggle, so at its speed is one wiggle per second, and the wiggle amount is 50 pixels. Now if I hit play on this, this does a pretty good job. I'm not going to lie, right out of the box, that looks organic and handheld. Now, just to make sure that I don't get any black bars, I'm just going to click on the edge here on one of these handles, hold down the shift key, and I'm just going to go ahead and zoom in a bit so that just in case it wiggles, we don't get any black bars on the wiggles just like that. And now the final step, if you want to go ahead and increase the... Um, the the amount that it wiggles like if you want to go let's say let's go for like 70 pixels instead of 50 this has a far more organic handheld -y look but maybe it's a bit too much depending on what you're going for and that's it you just go ahead and adjust this if you adjust wiggles per second you can get like a buzzing very fast wiggle effect which is more like a special effect than a handheld effect but this this works perfectly right out of the box there this is how you do it guys thanks for watching ton more stuff coming up stay tuned